Hi everyone, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out a lot. So hit that subscribe button. Today we're going to be making a custom order, but first I wanted to show you before I do my resin these days, I always run it through my airless bubble removal machine. It works great to get rid of the bubbles in your resin. I'll link it down below along with my coupon code. You can see there this resin had no bubbles in it. It works amazing. And I'll also link my full tutorial showing step by step how to use that machine and how I mix my resin down below in the description box. Be sure to go check it out if you want to see how I mix my resin and how to use the airless bubble removal machine. It's really super easy to use. So I had three ounces total and I just split that up in between these two molds. I did 1.5 ounces of clear in each of my molds and now I'm going to drop down my resin foils. Um, this, these two coasters are a custom order. She picked out these images that I had. Um, resin foils are not stick stickers. They're actually images printed on transparent paper. It's almost like a craft plastic and I buy these off Etsy. I will link the shop that I get them from down below in the description box. They come on a sheet, um, same size as like printer paper, copier paper, eight and a half by 11, and it's full of the images. And so you just take scissors, cut around the image that you want to use, and then you're good to use it in your resin creations. So I just place those down with the holographic side facing down and then just push it down all the way to make sure it's completely covered with clear resin. And I also make sure there's no air bubbles trapped underneath the image. Sometimes air bubbles will get trapped under there. So if you see an air bubble, just take your gloved hand, push on where the air bubble is, and it'll slide out from under the image off to the side of it and then you'll be able to pop it with your heat gun and let it cure overnight this is the next day these were the colors that she picked she wanted pink and blue with pink in the center and then blue around the perimeter of the pink so I'm just going to go in and fill up these molds the rest of the way these are so fun to make so easy to make the hardest part is just waiting for that first layer of clear to dry so you can go in and fill up the mold the next day and after I take these out of the molds I do finish them with a piece of round cork and I get that off Amazon the cork is absorbent and heat resistant so with all my coasters I include a little note that says says to use the cork backside of the coaster when it is in use because the cork is absorbent and heat resistant. I just wanted to share that with you guys really quick and I'm just going to blend these two colors together with my little stir stick so there's not a harsh line in between the two of those and that's really it. I'm using the Let's Resin Epoxy today. It works really great for projects like this and I'm just going to let this layer cure overnight and then tomorrow we'll be ready to take these out of the mold. And I apologize in advance, I should not have demolded this out in the natural sunlight because you couldn't really see the image. It still turned out really pretty, but I should not have demolded it in the full sun because it was really hard to see that image. It turned out super pretty in person. This one I decided to demold inside so you could really see how pretty these turned out. So, so beautiful. Um, my customer really loved them and she's going to give them as a gift. So I hope that the recipient loves them as much as I loved making them for her. But let me know if you guys have any questions down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching and go check out a few more of my other videos. That really helps out my channel a lot if you watch a few of my videos back to back. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys soon for another video. Bye guys.